Hi, my name's Bob Grinier and I'm a volunteer with the Martin Fleischmann Memorial Project. On the 16th of January 2020, I ordered this book and by the 23rd, I had started reading it and by the 24th, I'd finished reading it. And this is Quest for Zero Point Energy by Maury B. King. And it's one of these interesting books, a bit like um, the work of Tom Bearden, uh, where he essentially is going through... Um, his presentations that he's given over a number of years and uh, essentially assembling them into a book. So um, you're seeing a record of progression. It's quite interesting because you see, um, so if I go, it, it was uh, uh, initially uh, made in uh, 2001 uh, and then it was uh, updated, I think, marginally in 2018. Um, but if you actually look at the contents here, um, he's looking through um, uh, from 1991 presentations all the way through to uh, 2001. And so it's, it's tracking a 10-year history here. And it's quite interesting because you, you see the progression of his understanding. Now, what I found absolutely fascinating about this book is what he um, established from looking through many, many papers by many authors uh, spanning many years um, is he came to very similar conclusions that I came to independently by actually looking at things under the microscope uh, in experiments like Line and Echo and Nova and so forth. And uh, so it's really weird to be reading things in this book. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a series of review videos on uh, phrases and little excerpts from this book. And so before I do that, I recommend that people go out and buy this book. It's inexpensive. I actually got it off Amazon in the UK and it came the following day. Um, so I only had to wait a day to get it. Um, and so that when I go to uh, draw your attention to several things that are said in this book, um, that you can see how it co correlates to things that uh, we've observed together in analyzing these various experiments over the, the last several years. Uh, and uh, also how um, uh, new information that has come since this book uh, can point to some of the things that are not so well explained or understood in this book and, and how we might have an understanding of how they all fit into the uh, broader picture. So um, I am recommending this book, uh, Quest for Zero Point Energy uh, by Maury B. King. Um, and uh, I think people will be very happy to read this and uh, see how it actually uh, fits into the broader picture that is emerging. Thank you very much for your time.